Now the topic is extraction of gelatin. How the gel, how we can extract the gelatin? How we can extract the gelatin for the preparation of a capsule? For the preparation of capsule. So gelatin can be extracted from either pork skin or bone. Either from pork skin, pork skin or bone. Bone, pork or calf. Pork or pork or calf. So, if I have extracted from the skin or bone, then I need to treat with acid, one side acid. See, this acid sequence is like this, this base sequence is like this. Then I have treated with acid, then I have treated with acid. <coughs> then leads to the formation of collagen, it leads to the formation of collagen then formation of collagen then i make the hydrolysis by using at 80 degrees then i will do hydrolysis of this collagen at 80 degrees centigrade then leads to the formation of gelatin then leads to the formation of gelatin then whatever the gelatin i have obtained either that is gelatin a or gelatin b the gelatin whatever I have extracted that is either gelatin A or B here A refers gelatin A refers that is treated with acid B refers if this gelatin is treated with base B refers base so now what will be the, what will happen is gelatin A whatever the gelatin A this is responsible or it imports elasticity, plasticity or clarity of the cell. Gelatin A refers, it imports elasticity, plasticity or clarity of a cell. Gelatin A having char charge, gelatin A, gelatin B having charge, this isoelectric point means at which the pH at which both positive and negative charge get neutralized, the pH at which positive and negative charge both get neutralized at pH 9, isoelectric point at pH 9. <coughs> so, see, for acid in the basic environment, See, at pH 9, this isoelectric point is there. This is about gelatin A and its isoelectric point. Now, the gelatin B. B refers, that is extracted by, treated, by treatment with the base. Now, what will happen? It imports toughness. Toughness and firm means strong film. It imports tough and firm film but brittle it is easily broken the whatever the film formed by using gelatin a that film is easily broken brittle hence hence we are using the combination of gelatin a and gelatin b for the for the manufacture of for the manufacture of gelatin capsules for the manufacture of gelatin capsules we are using both gelatin a and gelatin b gelatin b responds to formation of tough and Thermophilic, but it is brittle. So whatever easily broken, brittle means easily broken. But this gelatin is having elasticity, elasticity or plasticity. So that this this disadvantage can be manipulated or this this gelatin A disadvantage can be overcome by using gelatin A. Gelatin A it is having elasticity or plasticity along with clarity of the shell along with clarity of shell so gelatin B hence we are using both gelatin A and gelatin B for the manufacture of gelatin capsule shell gelatin shell capsule gelatin B having both positive and negative charge both these are get neutralized at pH 4.7 see this is a base now this is this isoelectric point is in the acidic medium acidic medium 4.7 acidic medium are uh, then then whatever 
So what are the characteristics? So what are the characteristics of that gelatin shell means this gelatin? Obtained by obtained by using gelatin and gelatin gel. What are the characteristics? Iron content not more than 15 parts per million. Next, bloom span 150 to 100. 150 to 200 grams. Bloom span 150 to 200 grams. Iron content compared to Fesca city 25 to 45 milli boys. 25 to 45 milli boys. Next, moisture content 12 to 15 percent. Moisture content is 12 to 15 percent. This is about extraction of gelatin. Extraction of gelatin and gelatin A, gelatin B, and their types, what are their characteristics.